today's video, I will explain you how you can optimize the import and how you can also uh, clean up, reformat your code when you save a file on PHP Storm or even when PHP Storm automatically saves a file, when you do a comment S, it will automatically reformat your code, clean up your code, maybe even optimize the imports um, alphab alphabetically. And how you can do that? Well, very simply with macros. So macros is a really nice feature available on PHP Storm, IntelliJ, and so on. So in my case, I have PHP Storm 12, version 12. It might be a bit different for you depending on the version of your PHP Storm. So you see, um, that's my version. And what we'll do, we'll go to edit macros here and start macro um, recording. So we'll do this and it will record exactly every action I will do. So in my case, what I want, oh, uh, actually I need to be in a file. So I will go to a file and uh, what I want PHP Storm to do is to uh, first to reformat a file. I will say reformat code. That's the first action. The second one, I want to see actually the file already is already now reformatted. I don't want to rearrange the code because this is a bit too extreme in my opinion because because it will change the order of each um, method um, about uh, to move private to public methods uh, to change the the functions um, in uh, it will uh, rearrange in the alphabetically order, so it will sort every function alphabetically, and I don't want this, so I will uh, skip that part, but you can do it in your case if you want to have this kind of convention. However, for me, I will optimize the imports, so it will, uh, um, for every import, it will be sorted alphabetically, and then I want to save it, so I will do file, and uh, save so actually comment s comment s and now i will just um stop the micro to be recorded and i will just do um reformat on saving and i will save it and now if i go to macros edit macros I will see what I did. So first action is reformat code, second optimize imports, and third save all. And now what I can do, I will go to preferences, and here I will do to I will go to map. Um, what's the name? Uh, key map. So yeah, that's good. Key map. And here I have my macro here, and I will double click here double click and you do um i think actually yeah um right uh, right click as well and you can go to add keyboard shortcut and for me it will be um comment s when you save it you do uh ok and here it means each time you um, do comment S, it will reformat and optimize the import. So imagine I have another import, which is actually, it won't be used. So it will be um, that one, that's an import. And I will uh, change the, um, the format. So this is not MSR2, so it's not the convention of PHP. I will save it. So let's do command S. Oh, this, is, this one is fine, but if I do this, you see, it will reformat automatically, um, automatically for me. The import, uh, the, unused report, the unused import got removed as well. So here, if I have another one, and however, if I use it, like um, um, I will use this exception, like here, so that one will be used. However, 
um, if you save it, oh, sorry. However, if I uh, move it to the top, uh, T is before you. So if I save it, you see it will also reformat my imports. Again, if I have another import, a non-used import, it will automatically remove it. For instance, that one, it will get removed. And you see, this is really nice because we are sure that every time we save our code, it's in the right format we want. I hope it helps and let's see in another video.